Okay, so I'm just going to film. I think you can hear me over at a voice in the other room. I think you can hear me, so I hope so. Anyway, I am Kim. I'm here to do Aries. You're reading for the next 48 hour. And um, what we do is envision this divine white light or whatever color you want it to be. Voice has kind of a blue tint to it for me. It's burning myself. And I want to start with this Enochian language word of the day per se word of the reading I guess to teach um, to learn this ancient language loss is the word l-a-s like Las Vegas um, it means rich so Enochian word of the day La loss richness richness okay so yes Ooh, Aries what is richness to you? It's probably different things to different people. <clears throat> this is rich, rich loss. Okay, so tapping into that light. It goes through the chakras, however you want to visualize it coming from you. It's your energy tapping into divine source and that's what I will be tapping into too. Meeting you on the unified field. Okay. Queen of Disc is the issue for your reading. This is the journey of the sacred beat, by the way. Your challenge, wow. <laughs> so the Queen of Disc, already a good card to get. Ace of Wands. It's your challenge. Okay. So something's coming in materially with this Queen of Disc. Where you're receiving, you're in that receiving mode, Divine Feminine Energy of just doing really good finances coming in on the day-to-day -day. you're probably a practical person practical thinker warm compassionate abundant the heart of the matter possibly about a bunch of choices i have seduction here because it could be that some kind of choice is trying to like lure you in to a certain choice i don't know i don't know be keep your uh main mind and heart clear i'll clarify that past energy the nine of swords reverse is like no i'm not gonna worry about what's not mine you let it go that's good because that's finding the solution to something it could be that you came out of a very dark period with that car that can be indicating that so goals or destiny spot for aries that one's wanting to come out goal or destiny two of cups in the reverse hmm. okay we'll see whoa We'll see what that's about. Oh, what is the future energy? Ace of Cups. Finally letting go of a past partnership or connection because of this new thing coming in with Ace of Cups. You have many choices. Seeing them clearly is going to be really important. Even though you can do everything on your own, you have a challenge being a new passionate beginning. How are you feeling? <clears throat> You're feeling L-A-S, rich, loss. Oh, yes, you are, right? You are feeling rich. The journey <laughs> card, the full card, and the eight of disc. <laughs> the eight of pentacle. This is, um, wow, beautiful, because this is taking a leap of faith in yourself for a new um, journey regarding what you do on every day the practical ordinary things of life but you're getting really skilled like at something you have mastery or you feel you have mastery over these day-to-day -day getting better and better accumulating the wheel on the bottom Ooh, okay so yeah you're feeling possibly rich hmm <laughs> That's interesting. Okay, they um in the environment. I think it's this card. 
but okay some other ones want to come out too this one's still sticking up judgment the path the awakenment the enlightenment to letting down these walls that you've built maybe to protect you at first but um there's something about opening up opening yourself back up <clears throat> you have strength and confidence or the power to overcome anything and then judgment here is, is good it's it's um to me it's like enlightenment awakening to um maybe something that structure is different is changing <clears throat> and not being really attached to any one specific way that this has to happen but letting your walls down is going to be very important uh what is the hopes or fears or fears <laughs> i keep getting like this one card that gets stuck the five of disc reverse and the hanged one in the reverse so it is about a waiting period being over and finally letting go of um this maybe loneliness or financial burden health concern like finally some good news waiting on some good news that could come it might be why that's there like that <clears throat> What is the outcome? The Queen of Wands. Look, you have two queens. The Queen of Wands and the Queen of Disc. And the Knight of Swords are reversed. So we'll have to figure out. It, it, mm, waiting for a moment. Waiting for the right moment. Is what I'm getting with that. And then King of Cups. Waiting for the right moment. And then you'll seize the day. This is sounding like a song. I don't think it is one though, but it's sounding like it isn't. It? Waiting for the right moment to seize seize the day. Opportunity. The Queen of Wands is bold, brave, confident, psychic, psychism. It's a waiting for Okay. What else? And the, this might happen sooner than you think, this journey. <clears throat> really? <laughs> so I'll take them. Change. Courthouse. Sudden wealth. I'll pull these over. So it might have been something wasn't as sudden though. It may have been something that took a while. But you can see the ship coming in now and there's definitely change. Taking a risk, waiting for a moment to see it's the day. The main male family room. Okay. Who's this main metal? And we're going to shake up my tiny tarot, actually. And I can't see them when I'm pulling them. The underlying issue is the King of Cups, so you could be really mastering the mood right now or meeting somebody that's able to resonate or vibe well with you on your level uh, heart-wise. Another hangman. You've been waiting for a while for something. Waiting for quite a while. Two of Wands, Focus, Alignment, Planning, Prepared for a Change, that's possible, and then I have the Eight of Disc again, Prepared for a Change, Planned for a Change, I knew this wasn't so sudden, but it is like still touch this wealth, this rich loss <laughs> good news something moving forward there are many choices many options this could be the knight of wands energy wanting you to move towards them or them moving towards you but it is movement or travel is indicated getting together with people spending time outdoors and really healing Socializing. Garden. Socializing. Ch 
child, something in its infancy. Clover, success, something in its infancy, something just beginning, maybe this wealth just beginning. Military 22, the, and the official person or the uh, powerful friend, ally. It could be your energy, though. It could be like an emperor energy. This is like coming together maybe for purposes of um, committing to a partnership regarding products. Ooh. Wow, somebody that <laughs> who can predict possibly fame, fortune predictions i'm getting from that this is the lenormand moon um but being in the spotlight fame is there with the moon that's too many that's too many hang on <laughs> reshuffle reshuffle them what do you have for this two cups reverse then tell me about that mm. observing learning page of swords news don't want to get pulled into people's disagreements or arguments. Don't want to be around arguing. It might be about what your intuition is telling you about what to change, what to get away from. And then there's change. Yeah. Right? Something that was draining you of your health, that's changing and health is getting better. York, you're either you're elevating you're rising in some way you could be relocating there is birth of a something <laughs> something that puts you in the spotlight you're deep in somebody's thoughts connected <laughs> I just heard that th you know uh, connected <laughs> when your headphones I don't know you're deep in somebody's mind telepathic connected endings endings end of a situation somebody going out of your life or end of a situation might be that one that, that you feel like you should get away from maybe that one a letter a message and birds oh talk of the town about your effort and hard work rich gent bouquet offer surprise unexpected Romantic or business, you have a lot of receiving. You should expect to attract everything here that you really want. <clears throat> the Queen of Wands. Yep. Rich gent could be about the actions taken or needed to be taken. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh. Okay. Master number 33, look, and then angel numbers on the bottom. They're talking to you. Angel number is sequences of numbers that carry divine guidance. You have 33, master number 33. The ruling planet is Neptune. Your prayers have been answered. The master teachers here <laughs> might be you. Three, ascension number three, air, in breath, decodes, energies. And then you have angel numbers literally popping out saying, yeah, pay attention to these angel numbers. 11 11 i'm awakening and one i am innovative wow this card always blows me away <laughs> these cards always blow me away and then four you are the the stability you are this uh emperor energy you bring stability and rationality to any situation you're the hard you're the rock and your hard work and perseverance make you a dependable friend, partner, or colleague. I am stable. Number eight, I am successful. Your talent for setting and reaching goals is like no other. You are self-sufficient and capable of achieving your ambitions. Eight, representing the ebb and flow, the infinite loop of creation. I am successful. And if you would like um, a private reading, by the way, I'm a pioneer on the bottom, 19. That information can be found in the description box below. 
and like subscribe if you haven't subscribed already thanks for coming by Ooh. foolishness you are worried that by letting go of your frustration those who are responsible will perceive they have one but they have one because the only one suffering is you worthwhile oh i like this one life is not about being taught a lesson about getting something wrong it's about having an experience that adds the richness to your life and what was the word loss l-a-s equaling rich it's the richness all right thanks for joining me sending you love bye